this. Focus. Room full of maniacs. Fucking pal talk scum. Wow. Look at him. Hope he's uh, working the crowd. Yeah, there you go. He's high fiving. That's right. Put him in there. Balloons. There you go. That's your people. Yeah. There's there you your go. people. There's your people. That's right, Hope. Reach out to your people. <laughs> <laughs> wow. There you go. Wow. We bow to you guys. Thank you. Here they are. That's right. The masses. Yeah. Welcome to the worst show you're going to hear this year. <laughs> Fucking. There you go. Oh, there it is. It's like a Nambla meeting. It's like a Nambla meeting. <laughs> it is a Nambla meeting. <laughs> well, I gotta ask, uh, how many of you were here for last year's festivities? All right, got a couple of repeat uh, offenders that are here. Uh, <laughs> remember, 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 fuck, you, remember, fuck you trying to reach out to me. Oh, I know. I, <laughs> hey, how many guys? How I many just, of you are regular? I just want to know. I just wanted to know how many uh, people would have would know room. what to expect, uh, which is not much, and a lot of anger and racism. So, at least this year the bars open a lot earlier, so that'll help the broadcast. I said it. I don't know if it was drowned out by the crowd, but welcome to the worst radio show of the year. I'm gonna just say that. Right off the bat. That hurt. You guys, we want to introduce some people on the stage. They've uh, helped out the radio show tremendously while Jim Norton's being a star in Hollywood. Uh, let's hear it for Patrice O'Neill, everyone. Patrice O'Neill. Also known as T Bone on Arrested Development. <laughs> And you might know him as uh, one of the stock guys in the office. Right. No, I guess they don't. <laughs> I said might. I didn't say definitely. <laughs> <laughs> Next to Patrice O'Neill. You know him, you love him, and sometimes you hate him. It's Rich Voss, everyone. <laughs> oh, listen to the ovation. <laughs> you know what? These fucking guys will go wild over this leprechaun, right? Oh. <laughs> go fuck yourselves. <laughs> Look at it. It's like oh, it's like being it's like stuff. being at a Nambla meeting. <laughs> what it is. Uh, <laughs> it's like it's like trying. You know what it is? Yeah. It's Rich like. A, <laughs> Rich Boston! <laughs> First of all, uh, why don't you try chanting something he's not used to hearing? Bonnie yeah. is funnier! Bonnie is funnier! <laughs> look at a little fucking, look at that little fucking fidget. Here's the deal, you motherfuckers. Any of you that come see me live will never say that again. Okay, now kiss my ass! <laughs> all right, Rich, Rich Boss, is everyone. talking shit! Yeah, I'm talking smack. I'm talking smack. And, then, but, and finally, on the end, let's hear it for Bill Burr, everyone. Bill Burr! See that, Rich? Uh, you ever feel that in an improv? That's what happened. <laughs> they that, love him. He was also him. here. Uh, he signed up for a second tour of duty for a St. Patty show. Bill was here last year, uh, very early in his career on our show. I yeah. think it was only your second appearance on the show. And, oh, yeah. Uh, he left, and again, I had to get the horrified Bill Burr speech about how he's not sure if he wants... Uh, this show to be part of his resume of his career. And <laughs> that is absolute well, horseshit. Shut up, you fucking sheep. I, could turn I didn't even oh. know Ant. Hey, no. Burr, I could turn him on you in a fucking yes. second. <laughs> Stop well, acting I, like you're wearing your that's, sword. That's, I'm not afraid of you. <laughs> that's because he was doing Star and Buck back then. Oh, no. Do you think these guys know who that is? <laughs> <laughs> the first bird. That's because we're not... In the <laughs> Just because we're not in the studio doesn't mean we didn't bring the car crash. That's right. We need the car crash wherever we go. All right. You guys ready to meet Twitchells for the first time? Oh, thank God. Oh, yeah. We're starting off big. We're starting off uh, real big. <laughs> we had to sit in the dressing room with him uh, for a while, and he just babbled about his Tourette's. Yeah, he's enough already. He's really nervous. Ladies and gentlemen, Twitchells. Center stage, center stage, Quitchels. Where's he going? 
His direction. Right up front where you can be humiliated. humiliated. His sense of direction is correct. <laughs> that, 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 that was an accident. <laughs> Yo, what's up, guys? Woo! <laughs> hey, screw that. Now we can start to jump track. Jump. 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 Look at this twitching river dance motherfucker. <laughs> His pants have Tourette's, they're twitching off of him. <laughs> what the hell is this? Holy shit. <laughs> oh my god. Wow. He looks like an ugly Catholic Hepburn. This is awesome, guys. Oh, no. Well, uh... <laughs> I don't think there's anybody that doesn't know, but Twitchell's uh, has Tourette's syndrome and he's a stand-up comic. <laughs> Would you guys like hey. to hear some of his stand-up comedy? Hey. Let's give him like a minute. Yeah. Right. Let's give him a minute. Give what him a little hell? bit. Give him a little bit of stuff. All right. Yeah. Let's hear Twitchell's. I can't hear you! Oh. <laughs> oh he sounds like yeah. Bobcat. <laughs> wow, this feels great. Uh, Do I... No, it doesn't. You're not Tourette's. <laughs> two, two little owls walk into a bar. <laughs> He's fighting it. He's fighting it. Ah. His pants are wow. falling down. I found somebody. He really is in awful shape. I never noticed that. You people are as fucked up as my therapist. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, you would think someone twitching all the time would be. Oh, this cat. This. Is that better? I found somebody oh, that spits more than me. <laughs> you know what? what? I, guys, I met Rich Ross for the first time backstage, and for once, I finally feel fucking normal! Yeah! It's a, uh, it's a feel-good presentation. <laughs> Give him a joke, Rachel. Sight! Sight! Give guys, a real thank joke. you so. You want me to go? Me to go. go. Yeah, go. Give, give him a minute give, of comedy. Give Let's him some, go. Give him some of your act. Woo! Guys, thank you so much for coming out. I appreciate it. Oh. Yeah. Oh. Let him try one. Let him do one. <laughs> yeah. He can't get into his Isn't act because he's doing his act. <laughs> Twitchels, do your act hey. for like one minute. Ask All right, people. Ask him where they're from. <laughs> I am so happy to be here. This is great. You know what? A lot of things, people are asking me, what's it like to have Tourette's? What's your name? You. He's working the I, I want you to take he's your right hand, start the banging floor. it on your head. Start banging it on your head. All right, now try to take your left hand and start banging it on the other hand at the same time. All right, now try to bite her nipple at the same time. Yeah! <laughs> that's, that's. What did you see of her? They love it. They absolutely love they it. They love it, honey. He's working on some new shit. Right. <laughs> <laughs> he's, got a, he's doing premium plans next month. That's it? No. Absolutely well, not. Well, what's his real name? He's not an actor. He's an actor. Oh, it? It's Lewis. So they're just chanting Lou. That's <laughs> it wasn't Boo. They were saying Lou. All right, Twitchell's one more joke before we move on here. One and, more and, joke. And make it a joke. Wait, wait, wait. What's, what's your name? What's your name right there? Wait a second. No, no, I'm serious. Have you ever fucked anyone with Tourette's? Because you look familiar. Oh! Just... <laughs> oh. That, that, that was good. You look familiar. I get that guy. It came through Tourette's clay. Yeah. <laughs> what, is, what is Patrice doing? <laughs> All right. All right, listen. We're already losing control. That's all right. You guys, let's hear it for Twitchells. We're going to move on here. There he is. Your favorite Tourette's comic. What a mess. He is a mess. They're chanting jump as he leaves the stage. All right, you guys. from a building. Nothing? <laughs> you guys, one of our greatest creations is hitting the stage right now. Let's hear it for Big A. Oh, wow. He's got an Adolf Hitler haircut. That is, like, that is like Shemp Howard hair. <laughs> Adolf, 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 Adolf. Someone get a Sharpie. Yeah, we need a Sharpie. Get a Sharpie, motherfucker. Hey, Big a Sharpie? A. Get me a black Sharpie. Big A. 
You gotta I, I got something that'll go great with that haircut. I need a black Sharpie. Yeah, you gotta put up with this shit. Oh, come on. That haircut, where'd you, where'd you get that? Yeah, come on, lean in. All right. Anthony is making a Hitler mustache on Big A. Oh, he looks terrific, too. Well, he's got the, uh, he's got the eight off haircut, so we gotta give him the mustache now. That's not coming off anytime soon. <laughs> There it is. I turn around and uh, meet your. <laughs> that's not right. Hey, it's with one hand. Oh, like that's, this. that's not right. Hey, the Fuhrers had a little too much bratwurst. <laughs> All right, everyone. <laughs> let's let's get a few words from Big A. Big A, address the crowd, will you? The mic doesn't work. He puts him in the oven, then he. Gerbil's head's gonna roll for this one. Is it on? Hello? Now the mic is on. Now the mic is on. Here we go. They're trying to get his wireless mic to work. We got the roadies on the stage fixing Big A's microphone. All right, you guys, let's hear it. Let, let Big A talk for a minute. Here we go. Big A, everyone. I want to wish everybody a happy St. Patty's Day. Big A, it's like this. <laughs> oh. <laughs> this is so wrong. <laughs> hey, where, where'd, you, where'd you get the haircut, really? Actually, uh, um, a friend cut it for me. A friend cut it for you. No, an enemy cut it for you. Yeah, that's a joke. What did he use? Like a, a bowl and a razor no, right around the back? Because I got to say, the back looks like those old Our Gang kind of uh, haircuts from the 30s. What? It's a fat little wrestler. It really takes away from the rest of his look. Yeah, it really uh, brings everybody's yeah. eyesight up yeah. to the hair and you don't concentrate on the rest of the... Uh, ugh. I <laughs> that fucking walking mess. Go ahead, do some stuff. That's fantastic. The haircut and the mustache of uh, Adolf Hitler and the body of Hermann Goering. <laughs> Come on, it's funny if you watch the Hitler channel. <laughs> I do every day. All right. What we're going to do now is we're going to bring Twitchells back on the stage. And we're going to have, uh, if you guys are uh, faithful listeners of the show, and obviously you are, you guys know Big A and Twitchell's read the news for us on our program. Well, today for St. Patty's Day, they're going to do a little story of St. Patrick. The Aww, story of St. Patrick. Sticking with the mood, this is going to be fantastic. The with, story of St. Patrick. Right there, yeah. With Twitchell's and Big A. <laughs> Fuck you! Nah! <laughs> that was too loud. You're blowing out my eardrums, Twitchell. All right, you guys, here we go. It's Big A and Twitchell's The Story of St. Patrick. <laughs> go ahead, Big A, get us going. <laughs> <laughs> Hold on, hold on. Just in case people are wondering, Big A has started reading. He just can't get past the first word yet. No. <laughs> Sound A, it out. Big A has problems with words that start with ST. He can't say them. And the first word is stagger. Let's see if he can get to it. All right. Once again, it's Big A, Twitchell's The Story of St. Patrick. Big A, start us off. <laughs> Oh my god. Close up thing. Alright, Anthony, Anthony, we're losing. 
<laughs> We're losing control here because he really can't get it going here. Come on, Big A, what's the matter? All right, you gotta talk loud into the mic so they can hear you back home, you know. Yeah, talk right into the mic and get those ST words out. Come on. All right, here we it. go once again. It's Big A and Twitchell's The Story of St. Patrick. Step up to the to the edge of the stage. Yeah, get still. closer right, to the on, people. Come on! Come on. <laughs> All right, come on. Big A, come on. Here you go, Big A. All right, Big A, here we go. <laughs> He's not on. Uh, He's not on. Off again. Uh, the first, uh, do, you, do you want me to start from my part? <laughs> Is your mic on? It's not on? Are you sure? <laughs> Got it. Who's gonna get drunk with me? Yeah, that's what I like. I love it. Wait, who will have sex with me? Can somebody grab that fucking mic away from you, sir? Thank you, sir. Jesus. Twitchels, give me the fucking mic. Until that glitch gets worked Ooh. out. Anthony, explain what's going on here, And by man. glitch, I mean him still breathing. <laughs> right. Holy shit. He just blew out all our eardrums uh, up here on the stage. Oh, holy crap. Yeah, I don't know. It sounded like they went to turn up Big A and turned up Twitchels instead, which is a horrid idea. That was very, very bad. Wow. Like a, My head's yeah. spinning. <laughs> there was awful, awful feedback there. I'm glad they test all this shit out beforehand. We never go out on the road without a full testing of everything, right? <laughs> and we test right when we hit the air. Oh. That's when the test starts. All right. My God. I heard a great chant uh, before when the curtain was closed of show your tits. Uh, what happened? Who was that? Yeah? And, and she showed, but then I heard, I heard a suck that cock chant. Oh, there we go. There you go. All right. That'll Opie tits calms them down. <laughs> I know. I, I, I know how to work it. <laughs> uh, oh, hey, how you doing? Hey, how does that guy have tits? Your hair's a little short. So you wow. look you you look like Harry Potter with nice cans. <laughs> I gotta be honest with you. You kind of got the ground glasses, the short hair. You got a boyish little look, but you got great tits. As does fantastic. little Harry Potter. That's great. Can you, uh, can someone lift her up so maybe she can show the crowd? Because those are pretty yeah, good. Yeah, we already got a beach ball going. Yeah, lift, just lift her up a little bit. Hey, guys, look, we got a good caliber of girl here today. There you go. That's nice. Look, not bad, right? Get out of the way, Twitter. You know, she was the, um... Yeah. Bruh, <laughs> fucking Vo, man. Oh, you see the nurse on Halloween? She, was, she, she did this on Halloween, too, I think. You remember that shit, Patrice. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah you're She's good Halloween. like that. All right, very good. Very good. Back into your people. Take try care. not to get uh, picked up like a bowling ball by those animals. Go back out. All right, are we stupid enough to try this again? Yes, yes. we are. We certainly are. All right. I wanna, you know why? It's the spirit of St. Patrick's Day right. that we're trying to get across with these two idiots. All and right. I'm not going to let equipment problem problems uh, get in the way. Plus, well, you're educating people. Uh, uh, thank you, Bill. Of, of course, it fits the whole reason we're here yes. today. And, and it's to a drink and be racist. It takes Big A so long to get going that it, it, it fucks up everybody. Oh, them? I know. All right, we're going to try this again. It's not like they have a long attention span, these people. They're making Twitchell jump again yeah, on stage. He's fighting it. He's fighting it. We're just kind of stalling. We're trying to get the wireless mics going again. I, I, oh! There he goes. See, he was fighting the urge, but he had to jump again. Anthony, there's also Pal Talk cameras all over the Hard Rock today. Well, apparently so. I can't get them up on my camera, so I don't know what uh, they're going. But uh, hopefully they're out there and uh, people are tuned in uh, watching the festivities as they happen. Watching might be better than, Fantastic. than hearing at than this point. Than actually or being here. <laughs> exactly. All right. Is uh, Big A ready again? 
We're going to try this Give again. Give it a try. All right, get out there, Big A, if you're ready. All right, here we go. We're going to try this one more time. It's Big A and Twitchell's <laughs> The Story of St. Patrick. Big A, whenever you're ready, start. The first word he's going to attempt to say is stagger, by the way. Here we go. Nice and loud, it? Big A. Stagger <laughs> closer, friends, and let me start the stimulating story of St. Patrick, a tale deep in history. Oh. All right. Patrick was born in the second half of the fourth century A.D. in Brighton. He was born by such a... <laughs> oh, brother. All right, he was born, whatever that means. But okay. I, I don't know. <laughs> he was born Malascott and did not change his name to Patrick <laughs> until he became a priest much later in, in life. <laughs> As a teenager, he was... <laughs> was yeah. stuck into shackles and kidnapped by a whole work group of pirates and sold into slavery in an island. After six years of stomaching... <laughs> what? Stay <laughs> and sold to Patrick's Patrick stole. Patrick stole. Help us out. Oh my God. Stole away from his captors. Jump ship, if you will. And if you will. Started. Started. Started to study in the minus. Did you pick up the pace? All right. <laughs> Back to Twitchell's. Patrick studied there for many years, eventually being bequeathed the honor of bishop in the year 42 by Pope. It is said that God soon. I wish you could see us at home, man. Twitchell's just sweating like crazy. They're making him jump like a nut. <laughs> What a what a wreck! <laughs> <laughs> Come on, Big A. What are Big you a, nervous? Let's go. Oh, <laughs> Big what A's a head's made out of titanium. Poor <laughs> oh, Big A. You oh, a fucking hit the mustache. <laughs> it looks like oh, he's gonna have a nervous breakdown oh, on the stage. Man. You're right there. You're right there. Oh Jesus! Sound it out. Look at, look at can't Mr. Read. Showbiz legend. Switchles really yeah. bugs me. Oh, is he the most annoying oh, son of a well, bitch? He's helping he the looks like one. a retarded Jackie Gleason. He's a Patrick Hawkins and a wolf way. way. We could go under the local authorities. I was arrested and he got fucking into this. Snot running down into his, oh, yeah. into his magic marker mustache. Jump, <laughs> was able to jump to freedom each time. Patrick was credited with oh, fuck me. Uh, the to set up standing oh, yeah. of He looks like an extra on Deadwood. Studying <laughs> 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 the Holy Trinity. If only Neil using a shamrock. All right, back to Twitchell's. We're just about done. Patrick with this has story. been credited Jesus. with founding more than 300 churches in Ireland. <laughs> 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 I feel like I'm at a Led Zeppelin concert. <laughs> <laughs> and founded. <laughs> 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 He also escaped more than 12 attempts on his life. Sounds fucking familiar. <laughs> All right. <laughs> All right, we finally end with Big A. Go ahead, Big A, finally. 
Legend also states, states, legend, legend also, also states, states, states that he stamped out the existence of snakes in Ireland. Although some still believe that this is simply a metaphor for converting all of the pagans of Ireland to Christianity. Patrick's life stopped Stop. his heart stood. <laughs> Do you like this? A March 17th, the year 461 of the standard. <laughs> Come on, get through this fucking thing. <laughs> He handed Christian calendar. His death is still driving in their car. Listen to still, yeah, still celebrated, celebrated every year to this very day. Now that you heard the tale, start, start, start. Sounding out Christianity. Start. 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 All right, let's hear it for Big A and Twitchells. Yeah. The story wow, of St. Patrick. Good job. I had no idea what that was about. When Twitchells was helping, it was like... It was horrible. It was like pork roll helping Scrapple. <laughs> All right, uh, who's the fidget? Who's the midget over there? Opie, they don't like being called that. Like oh, being called midgets. Hey, that... There he is. Here's and look at you. And he's married. Isn't that what this is all about? He's married. Here, get him this a guy, wife. This guy works once a year. He has a wife. He you runs. are. Uh, where's, uh, your, where's your wife? Uh, this is. Uh, he's a little person, Opie. A what little up? person. How tall are you, bro? Wait, my my height or my dick? Oh. <laughs> oh. I got. I got look smack. in my underwear. Has there ever yeah. been a funny midget? <laughs> <laughs> just, I mean, who could just stand on his material? <laughs> Those are great. Where's all the fucking Irish people? Those are great midget Brooks Brothers shoes he has on. All right. Those are Norton shoes. <laughs> you like my shoes, huh? Let me yeah. see your hands. I want to see if mine are bigger. Hey, nice teeth. Oh, my, oh, my wow. God. They're almost the same size. <laughs> they are very nice. comparable to midget hands, boss. <laughs> Hey, what, are we, what are we gonna do with the midgets today? You fucking horse two jackass! <laughs> oh! oh! Wow! Oh! Follow the yellow brick road. I thought there was only one horse two jackass! We got another horse two jackass! Yes. Oh! Oh! Someone throw what? him into the crowd, please. <laughs> Kick him off the stage, boss, will you? Oh. So now, uh, uh, so, li yeah. little guy, uh, what do you do? You, you just, remember me? You just, no. Hey, you bust a point, Dexter. <laughs> <laughs> I just, you, you dress up like this every, uh... Every day except holidays. You oh, today's a holiday. Oh! You lost weight and got kicked <laughs> Come out. Come on in here. Andrew Dice Midget. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> I'm over here now. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> there he goes. Is hey, that... do Seinfeld. What? <laughs> this motherfucker has the confidence of a dwarf. Whip him out! Oh, no, look at him. Whip him out! <laughs> <laughs> nice chance. What is the midget doing here? Like, what do you do? It's yeah, a this... leprechaun. It's St. Patty's Day. Oh! Hey. Hey. Oh, my God. It's, it's so, age Who wants to see my shillelagh? <laughs> So one day a year, he gets to feel no. good about himself. And you get a lot of attention one day a year? No. Yeah, one day a year, I get... Well, no, on Christmas, he plays an elf. I got a fucking shillelagh right, <laughs> right here. Oh, oh. Days, two days a year. Two days a year. He pulled yeah. out the shillelagh joke twice. <laughs> two times. <laughs> so do you, dress, do you dress as an elf on Christmas, too? An elf on Christmas, a leprechaun St. Patty's, and a fucking male stripper once in a while. Yeah. <laughs> oh! Some stage diving. I want to see the midget yeah. stage dive. You think you guys could uh, handle uh, the midget stage put diving? On some, put on some fucking stripping music. I'll fucking strip right now. Yeah. Hey, he's having a better set than Twitchell. He certainly <laughs> is. And he's got more dignity. Wait, he really <laughs> wants the, the, the midget really wants to strip. Do we have any house music we can throw on? Yeah. We got any house music for the stripper? Here we go. 
His, ba- his hands barely met behind his head. I know. His hat's bigger than you. There you go. It's, <laughs> it's leprechaun strip tease. This one's for the ladies out there. All kind of Oh, yeah. Hey, hold on. Oh. His bodyguard shot him. I saw that motherfucker. Yeah. All he, right. He has a classic security haircut. <laughs> hey, you know how I usually uh, boot people from Pal Talk? Oh, uh, look. Rich Foss ran on the stage to collect all the dollar bills. <laughs> yeah. What are you insane? What? Do you know if you if you throw shit, uh, keep it at the midget, not at us. Jesus, Jesus Christ! What are you crazy? Yeah. How bad is your aim that you hit do us you, instead of the midget? Do you honestly think if I get hit with something, this is like a big pal talk room? If I get hit with something, you'll be bounced, literally. No throwing shit. Now the midget really has low he's self-esteem. Back. All right, he's back to pick up his he's belongings. picking up his stuff. <laughs> and he's out of here. Let's he's hear it for the... Pick up your uh, cash there. Uh, it's all yours. You earned it. He's got to give your money. There you go. It's That's very it. hard for him to pick up uh, money with those uh, hey, balloon hey, fingers. Pick my self-respect up right there, too. Yeah. <laughs> hey, uh, before we take our first break, we got to introduce everybody to one more person from the radio program. He doesn't do much, but he looks really, really silly. Let's hear it for half a Hulk face. No way. Half a Hulk All face. All right, half a Hulk face. Live at the Hard Rock Cafe. That is not a Halloween mask, everybody. That's the real deal. Half a Hulk face. What's up, man? What's up, man? How are you? How you been? Good? Hey, how you guys doing? Yeah. I need a damn drink. That's Who right. Give me a damn drink. This motherfucker's a rock star. Keep this That's guy in that booze. Drink. Drink, be merry, and fuck everybody else. That's Jesus. right. Wow, That's I've right. never seen more cameras go so off in my life. Yeah, come on. Get this guy half shit faced. <laughs> there you go. Let's go. I want to hear it. I want to get drunk down there. I want to drink. Eight, uh, half hold face. Move to this. To the edge of the stage. Everyone wants to take your picture there. Get close. Blah, they blah, love you. They love you. Blah, blah, blah. Holy shit. Holy shit. Holy <laughs> shit. Holy <laughs> shit. I love the chance. Oh, holy shit, Is You got loser? <coughs> oh, wow. Oh, oh shit. Hey, hey. Wow. we challenged you. Channel. Don't act like oh, you didn't hear it. You got yeah. Right? Yeah, you. We forgot Damn. to tell him that uh, half a Hulk face has an attitude. Yeah, I know. Forgot. He don't take no That's stuff. what I thought. Smart That's up. The midget lives in this side. He don't take any. There shit. you go. That's what I'm talking about. I think it's gonna pour out the other side of his mouth. <laughs> <laughs> What's he gonna do? Put it, drink it through his eye? There he goes. He's chugging a beer for the crowd. Half oh, a whole shoot. face. There he goes. There you go. And Opie, and wouldn't you? He just turned the crowd around. Wouldn't you just be drinking yeah, all good. the time? It's, that was good. It's still in his jaw like a pelican. <laughs> <laughs> oh, All right, half a whole face, everyone. Hey, he's going to be hanging out. Uh, you Very see nice. him out there, buy him a beer. Buy him a drink because uh, uh, would, wouldn't you want one, really? I think wouldn't this, you drink all day? I, I think this is what's going to happen. We're going to take a quick break. When we get back, we're going to do a little karaoke, right? Karaoke was a big hit down at uh, F. your H. brother's Riley's, place, F.H. Riley's. Riley's. And uh, we're bringing it here live to you. Is Stalker Patty here? Is Stalker Patty in because the house? Because when she sang White Rabbit, uh, oh my goodness, it was wonderful. Where's uh, Stalker Patty? Where's Stalker Patty? There she is, so way we're gonna, back there. We're hey. going to take a little break. Wait, this is what I want to see happen before the break, though. Let's lift her up in the air and, uh, and bring her to the stage. Yeah. You guys just pass Stalker Br- Patty over the crowd until she hits the stage. Throw her like a dart. Here we go. Uh, Starker Patty's in the back of the room. They're lifting her up. Lift her up on the crowd. Let her crowd uh, surf to the stage. Oh, please, I'm afraid. Come on, Starker Patty. Someone <laughs> from the back of the crowd, lift her up. Here we go. We're bringing Starker Patty to the stage. Oh, here she goes. Get her up on the crowd. She doesn't and want to be lifted come up. Come on, huh? Patty, you pussy. I don't want to be lifted up. I'm 50. My hip could snap. They're going to try to carry me like a bowling ball. And there she is. Stalker Patty, everyone. What do you want me to do? When we get back, Stalker Patty will be doing karaoke. She's going to do White Rabbit. It's the Opie and Anthony program live from the Hard Rock Cafe for St. Patty's Day, baby. 
And we're back with the OB and Anthony program on XM Satellite Radio. We can't even hear ourselves think up here on the stage. No. Oh, it's a clusterfuck, but we're having a goddamn good time at the Hard Rock nah, Cafe. I can't hear anything. It's our St. Patty's Day broadcast. There we go. There we go. Ow. I don't know what made the radio. I just know we're back live, I guess, right? Okay. I'm going to have no hearing by the time this is done. It goes from you can't hear anything, and then all of a sudden, bam, you get full volume. Jet airplane. Exactly. Wonderful. Well, I'm looking at the uh, Pal Talk cam. It is now up. The Opie and Anthony live room is open, and someone's roving around and roaming around with a a laptop with a camera, and uh, I see them somewhere in the middle of the crowd right now. Where are they? Over there? There it is. Yeah, so uh, for the people uh, that couldn't make it here, they can see all the festivities uh, right here on, on Pal Talk. And, you know, uh, we got to admit, we only have four or five listeners. Howard was right. Howard was right. Yeah. We have four or five listeners and... Uh, the racist comic. <laughs> <laughs> oh, by the way, Howard Stern did not work today. He did not work on the radio today. No. He, he would rather hang out. We would rather hang out with our fans and do a fucking party. There you go. And you know what I call him for that? Lucky bastard. <laughs> I mean. Hey, where are the bagpipes? Here they come. Oh, no. Yes. What St. Patty's Day would be complete without some bagpipes? I feel, wow. like, we're, it, it, I feel like we're announcing a parade. Yeah. Like a cop diet or some shit. Yeah. Opie as Garfield makes its way down the street. This is wonderful. <laughs> We're sitting here parade side. And, uh, oh, thank you, Shelly Yeager. Look at the details. Look at the details on the float. It's just Isn't amazing. That fantastic. And, of course, here comes the Nike float. This one yeah. sponsored by Nike. And uh, these remember, these go to guys Nike for all your sneaker tough. needs. Yeah. They don't always look like they'll fuck you up. Like Hard these bad guy motherfuckers. Actually, Anthony, we're listening to <laughs> the guard, Pipes and Hey, Bob. guy, what's with the skirt? Excuse me? Serving Morris and Somerset counties. Wonderful. Go to www.tgtd.org. Hey, what, what percentage of their gigs do you think are funerals? <laughs> half. <laughs> Easy. And half is yeah. St. Patty's Day. Parades yeah. and funerals. <laughs> Too bad Norton's not here. Men in dresses. All right, you're doing all day. I mean, they're good. <laughs> I like how that guy's tapping his foot. I don't know where the beat is in this. They all sound the same. A toast. Celtic Frost. A toast. Hey, uh, you guys uh, drink Jaeger? Yeah, we want to thank Jaegermeister Hi. for supplying some of the alcohol at the Hard Rock Cafe today. Got a nice little shot girl handing out the Jaegermeister shots. Let's get some fucking Jaeger. <laughs> Best. Happy go, go. St. Patty's Day, you animals. Oh, go, go. And there you go. Another shot of Jaegermeister down the old gullet. Ah, drinking on the air. It's not early, early in the morning. It's almost like the old days, Obi. It certainly is. All right, let's hear it for these guys. The Good pipes and drums, the guard. The Thank pipe. you. Thank you, guys. Thank you. Maybe another little tune to uh, walk you off the stage with. Nigga, tell them to play the long version of uh, 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 In the God of <laughs> How long is that, 22 minutes? <laughs> Hit it, baby. <laughs> we could use that at this point. <laughs> hey, play the guitar riff for fucking uh, <laughs> Hotel California. <laughs> The one on the end is the best. Look at him. He's into it. Hoorah! All right! All right! All right. Hoorah! They go. They grab one of those colostomy bags. Semper Fi! Once again, it's the guard, pipes and drums, serving boards in Somerset County. www.tgtd.org. Oh, yeah. More than 100 years of piping experience. There they go. Bravo, gentlemen. Do you guys do Jay-Z? I know. <laughs> it's one of my favorite songs. That is probably the antithesis 
of the anti-black music. All right, that was great. Yeah, the, the that, black, was like, that was like my favorite. Black guys, that's one thing they've never incorporated into like hip hop nah, or anything is bagpipes. Yeah. White guy, you, white guy dress music. Is yeah. that what it is? White power. White power, <laughs> that's right, white power. Celtic crosses and everything, fantastic. <laughs> I know. All right, I think we're ready for Stalker Patty. That's Stalker right. Patty, come on back out here. We did yeah. this, uh, we did this late night karaoke at F.H. Riley's. Yes, yeah, she uh, is. Patty, I love Patty. And, uh, why don't we get the uh, Pal Talk guy up on stage uh, with the camera so we can get a, uh, a good view of Patty doing this tune, man. Is the titty girl Patty's daughter? No, you have to get fucked to have a daughter. Oh, Patty, you got to show him your tits first. That's right. Oh, jeez, we forgot Patty. We forgot Patty. You got to show everyone your tits. You know what the sad thing is? I've seen her completely naked. <laughs> that is really sad that you can even say that. Go ahead, Patty. Whip them out, whip them out. Hi, right, Patty. What yeah, do you want Stalker me to Patty. do? Flash in the crowd. One, two, there you go. All right. Those are fifty-year-old uh, tits. Was her was her pants? I've never, never been was her pants pulled up over her titty? <laughs> Somebody got hit in the eye by a hair. <laughs> that was beautiful, Patty. <laughs> All right, listen. Oh, half a Hulk face is on the Pal Talk camera right now. It's frightening. It's like I'm watching the hills have eyes. <laughs> Uh, when you come play <laughs> with me. What, why don't we get the uh, Pal Talk camera up here so uh, you yes, can get Patty. <laughs> All right, the Pal Talk camera is making his yeah, way, making his way up. And let's have Patty sing her play eerie you. rendition play with us. of White Rabbit. White Rabbit. Yeah, she did this during late night uh, karaoke. It was a hit. We figured we'd bring it to the rest of the country today. Are we all set? Is Pal Talk up on stage? Uh, working their way uh, back now. All right, slowly but surely, uh, making one their way to the stage. One pill makes you larger, and one makes you small. <laughs> and the one that I got makes you a worthless piece of shit. <laughs> Doesn't rhyme, but it's accurate. <laughs> Is that the Boss Loves Cock chant? <laughs> Nowhere. Where did that come from? It, it's awesome. a new one. It's not. It's a new one. It's not a party until you hear this chant. I gotta I tell you. First of all, there's 300 guys. I love cock. <laughs> oh, you're gonna take that? Oh, you're gonna take that? It's 300 right, guys for you. Uh, yeah. Good for you, Rich. Got you. Thank you got balls. You got balls. Yeah, he loves. Ah, please. <laughs> All right, Katrina. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just saying. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. Uh, he got you. Yeah, I, I mean, let's be fair. He, he did get you. He did you. Got you. All right, Patty is uh, very confused on the stage, so I think we should get her singing her song. All right, on, pa Patty. Patty, move closer to the uh, the monitor there. All right. Patty, can you read? Yeah, I can. Oh, from there. Yeah. Wow, your eyes work, huh? Yeah. Wonderful with those glasses. Corey gave her colors. All right, here we go. Stalker Patty doing White Rabbit, everyone. Yeah, baby! Bring it down the house, Stalker oh. Patty at the Hard Rock Cafe. Oh, do another one, baby. Let him do it again. Ladies and gentlemen. Oh, in the white room with black shirts, huh? <laughs> Damn, Patty! Wow. <laughs> Gotta give it to Stalker Patty. Like Grace Slick. It's like watching Grace oh. Slick. That's what they call me. I'm saying it different colors. That was fantastic. Oh, wow. Oh, Very nice. That was fucking psychedelic, man. That was good. What, Bill? I think she did that better than Grace Slick could at this point. Oh, absolutely. She's, uh, I think she's in line for the next generation. Like a Jefferson Chrysler. Right? Yeah, whatever they're calling it. It's like when days. that guy quit Judas Priest. Yeah. You just grab somebody random. Throw someone new in. She kind of has a Grace Slick now look to her. Yeah. Punched over. And she still has that hippie body. Right. <laughs> that Don't big nasty that. bush. <laughs> <laughs> oh, big Woodstock oh, bush. <laughs> <laughs> still got mud in it. <laughs> Don't take the brown ass. <laughs> hey, hey, you guys, we forgot to introduce uh, Schizo Bill to the crowd. And he's, oh. getting, and he's getting a little paranoid backstage, so we should bring him out here. No, Skip we already Bill. did that, Opie. Did we? Yeah, we already <laughs> brought him out. Skitto Bill got a little reprimand earlier right here. Oh, oh, oh. Uh, he was trying to sell bootleg t-shirts. Oh, really? This is somebody that's like in our organization uh, trying to sell bootleg t-shirts to the crowd. 
That's too good. Well, well, let's bring him out here for a couple minutes, you guys. Yeah, if that was a Sopranos, he'd get whacked. Absolutely. Here comes Schizo Bill. Look at him. This guy's the real deal, man. How you doing, Bill? I'm doing great. How you doing, Bill? I'm doing great. Hey, hey. Bill, how you doing? I'm doing great. Someone get me a beer. Somebody get Schizo a Bill drink? a beer. Hey, Bill, can you actually zip that up? Don't do shit. I see everything. <laughs> Schizo Bill doing his shot of Jägermeister, Anthony. Oh. I'm really not supposed to drink. Oh, really? <laughs> oh, with the medication. Oh, thanks for telling me now. Because hey, Anthony. Of the anti-psychotic medicine. Great crowd control. Don't throw shit. Uh, but I, <laughs> I ran out of that months finger. ago. <laughs> Anthony's like the it's my job as a teacher. comedian to make you oh. laugh. It's my duty as a schizophrenic to scare you. All right, here's Schizo Bill. He's facing the crowd now. Do a little of your act. Yeah, do a little of your act, Schizo Bill. Ladies and gentlemen, come to the stage right now. MySpace.com slash Schizo Bill. MySpace.com slash Schizo Bill. Yeah. Stop whoring yourself out. Hi, my name's Bill, and I'm schizophrenic. This, this... This comedy set is dedicated to all the deaf schizophrenics who can't hear their voices. I all the schizophrenics who thought they were Jesus. They all drowned. MySpace.com slash Schizo Bill. MySpace.com slash Schizo Bill. I am. Bill. Bill. Do your act. Do your act. I'm trying to do it. They're being rude. You're, That's okay. You've got to be a professional. Free tent your act to Apollo. Do your act. Plug shit when you're done. Okay. That's exactly. When I was in the mood. When I, Bill, for the love of God, do your hey, act. Hey. Bill, Bill, it might just be my opinion, but I think you're losing the crowd. <laughs> <laughs> All right, try one more time. Get in there, Bill. Get in there. Come on. Come Bill. on, Bill. Give him your opening when joke. I, when I was in the mental hospital, I used to forget things after I got shot treatment. I, like, I, he, some, re, like some really creepy guy, he laid chap. You too. All right, you got to tighten it up, Bill. Hey, boss, tell him what to do when this happens. You know. I, I, I'll tell you what to do. Run! Fuck sucks! Fuck sucks! No. Oh! Fuck sucks! Fuck sucks! Fuck sucks! He's winning the fuck! He turned him on Rich! Fuck Oh, what a dirtbag move! I know! Alright, great! He, he, he tried to charge me through to a death set at the improv! He tried to charge me! Yeah, he tried to charge me! Yeah, he's going anti semitic yeah, You are part of my t shirt now! And the hard rock won't sell me sell my t-shirts and I'm running out of medication money. Son of a devil. Expose him. I told him I put him on stage. All right, hold on. Wait, hold on. Wait, what's the hobby? First of all. Piece of shit. 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 All right, hold on. Anthony, what the hell's going on? Schizo Bill is accusing Rich. He tried to exploit the retard. He said would never do that. I want another shot. I want another shot. You guys can't have Schizo Bill as accusing boss of charging him for a spot. Yeah, he is. He's charging me for a comedy spot. And his sister said that's how you make it in comedy. All right, all hell is breaking loose. You scumbag boss. That's a scandal. Oh, my God. <laughs> really busted apart the Jewish stereotype. MySpace.com says Schizo Bill. MySpace.com says Schizo Bill. You should be trying to get a piece of his t-shirt stamp. All right, let's get Schizo Bill off the stage. Wait a minute. Stay. There's something important I have to say. Oh, fucking holy shit. There's a benefit for me. Get him off the There he goes. Isn't it supposed to be men in white coats to take him away? Not well-dressed suits. You believe he did that? I mean... No, we fuck with that's unbelievable. You charged him money, Rich? No, no. I it's a scandal, and this yeah. needs to be uncovered right all, now. We need to address all, this. We need to address this. Here's what happened. He's got commas got to pay their dues. They don't have to pay you. Well, you know what? It's like when I sponsor people, they got to pay you. They end. What the fuck? He wants Rich, to get up. did you spend all your last no. comic standing money? No, I'm loaded. Here's the deal. We were backstage, and I was you being want, nice. You Listen to this, for real. Why did you sew part you? of your boxer to your eyes on? First of all, <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to cut myself on this. All right, are we back here or what? All right. I have no idea what the hell's uh, making the radio. All I know, there's accusations flying by. Schizo Bill was trying to exact. Voss said something, and then Schizo Bill attacked Voss. 
And, uh, oh my God. and he got called a piece of shit. I think he made a piece of shit but move. We can hear all the mics now. What happened? Oh Boss God. was charging. He charged he ch Schizo Bill. He said he wanted a piece of his T-shirt sale that is show. And he charged no. him to, uh, to go on. He charged I believe Schizo Bill. Did you see the look in his eye? It wasn't crazy. He was a hurt man. Yeah. You, yeah. And then he said, Thank he's you. a piece of shit, right? Piece of shit. <laughs> Wow, this man. is fucking great. The worst. I fucking got up at 8 o'clock for this, you motherfuckers. What did you, what did you, make, what did you make from him? 10 bucks? <laughs> and, 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 and I made him so my D. I was, we're in Cleveland coming up and I said to him, if you want to come in, you can do a guest spot. Okay. And then Bonnie backstage said, but if you sell shirts, we take the money. Fucking with him. He's and he's really believing it. He's fucking doing right. Oh, oh, no. Can Bonnie do your bidding for you? No, she's back there. No. no, he's like Kobe bringing up Shaq right now. Right, right. I'm trying to be nice and give a nice young schizo comic uh -huh. a guest spot. All right, we're going to move on. We got a special guest at the Hard Rock Cafe. Oh, yeah. You guys, let's hear it for the Hogan family. Hulk Hogan and his family. Get the fuck, this is real Hulk Hogan. Oh, yeah. That's real Ooh. Hulk Hogan. Ooh. Oh my god. Oh my there god. Is. You're a legend, man. Oh, oh. fucking help. Ooh. Oh, man. Yeah. That's beautiful. Hi, girls. Oh, nice to meet you. Oh, 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 I don't have a guys. camera. Oh, yeah. Hopey. Nice to meet you, sir. Take a seat wherever you can. <laughs> the Hulk is posing and the place is going nuts. The Hulk. Oh, we get out? He is just working the crowd and they're loving it. Take a seat, Mr. Hogan. That's all right, anyone will do. There's a couple mics down there, too. A couple mics down there. But disrespect in front of Hulk. Hulk wants his wife to flash. Holy crap. <laughs> that was really funny, man. <laughs> Hulk pointed at his wife and said, flash the crowd. You know, uh, Hulk, you guys are cool. Hulk, what do you have to put up with having a very attractive daughter like this? Well, yeah, that's cool, brother, but let me tell you something. If my wife dropped those bombs out... <laughs> You guys would be passing out backwards. <laughs> What's going on over there, Anthony? I don't know. I think she was threatening. You're gonna you're gonna whip the crowd into a frenzy with that uh, with that body. Hulk, uh, why wouldn't it have been easier for you to have ugly children? Do you think it would have been easier for your life? Brother, thank God they look like uh, my wife, you know. Thank God. Yeah, but I, I think it would have been easier instead of having to have these guys trying to pick up on her and stuff. It's your daughter. It's your little girl. And you got to put up with these guys that you obviously know aren't good enough. Yeah, but Vince McMahon doesn't want me beating up the young punks in the WWE. I could beat up all these guys if they mess with my daughter, man. <laughs> That's true. Now, you have had to deal with uh, her, her dates, with guys coming over. Yeah, it's been, it's been crazy, brother. But, you know, she's almost 18. So you animals wait a couple more months <laughs> and she'll be street legal. Hey, what are you promoting her? <laughs> any, well, any, uh, any ideas about maybe uh, nude posing? Uh, oh, in all respect, uh, Mr. Hogan, any nude uh, photography when you turn 18? I don't know about nude, but there's definitely going to be maybe Maxim or stuff. Maxim, one of those hot bikini layouts. It, does it make you uncomfortable at all that she's uh, very comfortable with her body and willing to show it like that? And you, uh, you're her dad, man. Well, I mean, you know, it hadn't been shown so far, so we're still deep, deep under the radar, you know. So so far, so good. We've seen uh, enough where you know we could we get that uh, mental image. Hulk, not that I have myself. I haven't, you know, watched the show, seen your daughter, and then maybe put it in the Rolodex in your head for later <laughs> use. But 
I, I assume other guys have. Does that, uh, how does that make you feel? Well, every time our show, Hogan knows best which this Sunday night, brother, 10 o'clock. Yeah. 10 o'clock on VH1. The new episodes. Every time our show airs, Brooke's website blows up with all these guys wanting to know her sizes, where she's going to be, where she's singing at. It gets pretty crazy. Plus, Mrs. Hogan, my wife, Playboy, you want me to wrestle my wife? <laughs> Oh, they want another on, match. match. Anthony, I just got a note from backstage. Twitchells wants Hulk to chop him. Are you shitting me? Hulk, would you do a little move uh, with Twitchells for the no, crowd? No, brother, no. I, no more lawsuits. Yeah, he's had <laughs> no enough more of those. Lawsuits. Lawsuits. He's had enough of those. I don't want to stop his heart. <laughs> it would, you would do him a favor, though. He has Tourette's. It's this guy right it here. I cure him. Twitchells, come over here and say hi to Hulk Hogan. He's a big fan. He's a comedian, and he's the real deal. He has Tourette's. So, uh, oh, he's got to shake everyone's hands. <laughs> Whenever he hears the word jump, he feels compelled to jump. It's, and the crowd, of course, is very sympathetic to that. They yell it out every two seconds. Uh, Twitchell, what, what, how do you, how you feeling meeting Hulk? Say it again. How you feeling meeting uh, the Hulkster? I, I thought I had Tourette's really bad before. I'm fucking nervous around you. <laughs> <laughs> hey, jump. <laughs> jump. 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 <laughs> You're gonna tire him out. I thought I thought it would be a great honor to get chopped by Hawk. What is you would first of all, he'd kill you. You understand you would die? <laughs> And it might be the better of the two uh, lives that he's living right now. He's very strong. Yeah. <laughs> now, uh, Hulk, you were saying, all right, Twitchells, all right. enough. You were saying about your wife now. Uh, your I thought we forgot wife. about all that. No, I know, we don't no, forget. We don't. Lovely, um, lovely woman. Been married to her for 22 years, never had a fight, everything's cool. Really? 22 years. What's it like for her, though, to be married to, to this guy for 22 years? It's been a, a, a very exciting road, I'll tell you, because I was with him all through the WWF years. Yeah. Uh, we did a lot of traveling. Stop. <laughs> her kids. Uh, she's showing her your tits. Her tits. <laughs> Isn't that great? We said she looks like Harry Potter showing tits. <laughs> <laughs> I think not, Nick likes this place. This is all good. Right? Hey, yeah. Nick, Nick didn't see that. Yeah, My Nick son didn't. Hey, Nick. Hulk's son Nick needs to see that. There you go. <laughs> yeah. 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 Now he's happy. Now we got Nick involved. Hey, Nick, it's St. Patrick's Day, you know? Yeah. That's a special occasion. <laughs> Good enough reason. Very special. This place, as you know, used to be uh, uh, WWE. Yeah, this place was wild. I remember they had, uh, when I came in here, it was back in the Ted Turner days when the NWO was running for life, man. I came in here to eat one day. All the WWF superstars were in here, and there was not one Hulk Hogan picture oh, anywhere. Shit. That's because we were down in, in the south doing the NWO thing. But then uh -huh. we made shame. peace, and everything's good now. Uh, me and Opie have a history with this place also. Do you know that we were the uh, pregame show hosts for the XFL? <laughs> wow. wow. Yeah. Wow, that's a bad train to know where. <laughs> <laughs> that train never left the station. Unbelievable. Vince but, McMahon uh, picked us personally, though. Yeah. Anthony, don't forget. Thanks. <laughs> hey, uh, uh, the new season of Hogan Knows Best, what can we expect? Well, we can expect more Mort chaos. Brooks trying to break away. Nick is using the cameras to his advantage. He's got all kind of game. He's running with these 18, 19-year-old girls, so it's game on with Nick. And we made friends with the camera crew, so we don't even know the cameras there anymore. And, I mean, it gets pretty heavy this year, so you guys are going to be surprised. Yeah. Bravo, man. Uh, I, I was wondering, I, I know Sylvester Stallone's making uh, Rocky Balboa. Did he ask you to be any part of that? Because he's such a huge part of... Uh of uh, the first one. Well, you know, Rocky Three was great, but I kind of think III. it was weird when Stallone first went on the talk circuit, like on Jay Leno, not Jay Leno, but Johnny Carson and all those shows. When you talk about Rocky Three, they keep asking about Thunderlips, and I yep. think it got to the point where they don't want any more Thunderlips, you know, because it kind of like overshadowed the rest of the movie, but he's yeah. a good friend. He inducted me into the Hall of Fame last year, and I wish him all the best. Yeah, it looks like uh, it's going to be a pretty good movie. And looking forward to uh, the next season. Well, thank you so much, guys. This is awesome to have us out here. you got a, a great crowd of your own, man. you got a great following here. Hey, yeah. can I say something? 
think the past. <laughs> I really just don't think this day would be complete unless with a crowd like this uh -oh. here in New York City, uh -oh. Times Square, uh -oh. that Hulk Hogan needs to stand up here and tear off his shirt for no. you people. <laughs> oh yeah. There's a photo op. Come on, baby. Let's see the crab down the whole deal. That's you know? No, oh, man. Come on, Dad, show those those photo pythons. Op. Come on, let's do it. Yeah, that's just like seeing Brooke. Uh, <laughs> We'll, we'll, get, get we'll, drunk, get, we'll get we'll get we'll give him a couple poses. We'll give him a couple poses. All right, all right. <laughs> Here comes Hogan. All right, to the front Woo! of the stage. Hulk Hogan. Hogan knows best. This Sunday at 10 p.m. on VH1. Bravo. Bravo. He's making his way to the front of the stage, Anthony. Come on, baby. Everybody misses you. Sizing his fucking arms, man. All right, Hulkster. Here he is, Hulk Hogan. <laughs> Ah <laughs> oh, man, he needs to hear more noise, you guys. <laughs> you got some fans up in the back oh. there, baby. I don't hear them. It doesn't sound like Madison Square Garden. Come on, pump it up. Let's go. You can do better than that. Come on. Hogan, Hogan, Hogan. Woo! Woo! <laughs> yeah! Woo! <laughs> he didn't love it, babe. He knows how to work a crowd, man. So do I. Bravo! Bravo to Hulk Hogan! All right, Brooke, it's your turn. My turn? Yeah, your turn. Now it's Brooke's turn, everyone. Come on. Can do it? Yeah, you can do it. You can do it. Hogan, Hogan. <laughs> oh, oh, come yeah. on, you can do it. <laughs> she can't pull oh, security. You need some, do you need someone to use their teeth? I don't think I can do it. But do you guys want this? Oh, yeah. right, now they're throwing the Hulk wow. Hogan t-shirt into the crowd. Yeah. Here's yeah. Hulk Hogan's daughter, Brooke, making her way to the front of the crowd. One, two, three. <laughs> they work the crowd the same way, man. She learned from Daddy. There you go. Oh, oh, the oh my God, he caught it with his crutch. Caught it with his crutch. What a catch. And now he's going to need it. <laughs> Pandemonium here at the Hard Rock Cafe. Damn, Hulk, you know how to work a crowd, bro. All yeah, right. Man, there's some crazy Opie and Anthony Hulkamaniacs out there, brother. Absolutely. And, uh, that was only a pretty hot catch. My brother right there. <laughs> they love you, man. You guys are awesome, man. All right, let's hear it, you guys, for Hulk Hogan and his family. Hogan knows best this Sunday, 10 p.m. on VH1. Thank you so much. We appreciate it. We're back at the Hard Rock Cafe for our St. Patty's Day broadcast. Uh, yeah. What a mess. But we're having a good time. We want to uh, say hi to Damien Fahey from TRL on MTV joining the program. <laughs> Had a great time last time here on the show. We Had a good time last time. Yeah, yeah. I believe Twitchells was there. Hey, what, uh, what about Hulk Hogan? Bill Burr was uh, starstruck. All of us were starstruck to, to oh, meet Hulk, Hulk Hogan. Hogan. That's, that's, I had to get a picture. I was like Jim Norton. I literally stood there like a little bitch waiting for him to come out. You did. I really did, and I'm not yeah. going to apologize. Well, he's one of the most uh, well-known people. Uh, you know, you see him, you know it's Hulk. You've got to get a picture with him. Best Fu Manchu ever. ever. Fu Manchu. <laughs> ever. Who else is wearing the Fu Manchu? And then the guns. I'm sitting here. It was so embarrassing. The guy's sitting next to me, and his arms are uh, like holiday hams. And, and like this, this thing is dangling next to his. And I look like just like 18 of my arms to make up one of his. Exactly. So embarrassing. That's a man's man. I'm a, a man's man. That's a real man. I'm robbing that nigga. And I'm a faggot. <laughs> Stick that nigga up. Take but I have switched money. to Guinness. There you go. Happy St. Patty's Day. Hi. Anthony raising his glass of Guinness right. to the crowd. All right. Hey, uh, I think we're ready for more karaoke, huh, Ant? Yes, we yeah. have Stalker Patty do White Rabbit. 
Great rendition. Incredible. Uh, it gave me an acid flashback, and I never even took acid. That's how strong <laughs> her performance was of that song. But now I think it's time to bring it down a little, people. Maybe, maybe a song about love. And who, and who could sing that? A song about love. Yeah, all they're calling for him. Yep. You guys, let's hear it for Master Poe making his way Master to the stage. Po. Master Poe. Every karate killer has a soft side. <laughs> <laughs> That's it. Poe playing up to the crowd right now, Anthony. He looks like he's hosting the grind. Hey, nigga. Yeah, show me. Remember that yeah. show? Hey, yeah. let me tell y'all something. Bruce Lee sang Stairway to Heaven at the Palladium in Los Angeles. Don't you ever forget that shit. Did he? I don't know. <laughs> Make it shit up. Who cares? Why not? Master Poe, uh, give Master Poe a mic. Hey, Chuck Norris plays the violin, nigga. <laughs> hey, guys, I have to do that. I'm sorry. Uh, here he goes. Now he's all out of breath. He's going to be like Axl Rose when he did his comeback. <laughs> we know what he's going to say right here. Hit it! Holy Pluto! His battle cry. It's his battle cry, yes. That is the battle you know, cry, the catchphrase. His Jeff Foxworthy moment. Ah, <laughs> right. oh, yeah. Yeah, I need baby. My ladies to come out. Oh, yeah. No offense with you guys, but I'm not singing to you. Oh, yeah. You're not cute enough. He's got chalk dust in the back of his He must have beat Poe. up a teacher. <laughs> Poe is the man who will fight for your honor. <laughs> <laughs> Poe could no. be your hero. <laughs> I right, Master Poe's got three girls on wow, tour. that ass in the, the middle. Ladies, please. <laughs> and when a master comes along. Sexy, huh? All right, here we go. Master Poe singing a love song, everybody, live I at the Hard Rock Cafe. There's so many changes in my life. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, oh, oh. Master oh, Poe, oh, everyone. Oh, Master oh, oh. Poe. Yeah, Poe. Remember to vote for Poe, it's 1-800-4-IDOL-08-08. Hey, that wasn't bad, you gotta give him props for that. great. And your boy's still on. Right. Uh, that little goofy yeah, motherfucker. he's still, still on. on. Alright, there you go. Well, Master Poe, leaving the stage. I think Master Poe has what it takes to be the next American Idol. <laughs> he can kick ass and sing. <laughs> Congratulations, you're going to New Brunswick. <laughs> hey, uh, Anthony, we got to introduce Neo as God to the crowd, by the oh, way. Oh, wow, Neo's here. We got a celebrity in the uh, front row we haven't introduced yet. Yep. Can we uh, get him on the stage? Yeah, let's try to lift him up. Fucking I'm, asshole. Online, this guy's a killer, an assassin, just as deadly as Poe online. This is Neo is God. Neo. Working the uh, stage right now. What's Hi. up, Neo? Good to see you again, buddy. Turn around for a little photo op. This is Neo. Yeah, photo Neo op. Is God, bottom slash. Wow, he's freak. He, he doesn't hates like that. you. He, he doesn't does not like, like you, Patrice. <laughs> Who gives a fuck? He's got an American Best <laughs> jersey on. Which is wonderful. <laughs> oh, shit. And uh, it always likes, it looks like he's wearing Kevlar vest. Yeah. But, uh, I don't think he is. That's <laughs> just his chest. <laughs> hey, Anthony. <laughs> that DNA is a bitch. He looks like he's trying oh, to shoplift cool. a pot. That DNA is a bitch. <laughs> Yeah, you mix it up one way, you get a body like Hulk Hogan. You mix it up another way, and you get Neo is God. You know, it's the same principle. A sperm hits an egg. Later, you have a Hulk Hogan, or you have Neo. God has a sense of humor, people. Well, well this uh, well, that nigga sperm bounces off actions. the egg. <laughs> this sperm hit the egg from the fiftieth floor. Somebody missed <laughs> <laughs> this thing. Hey, wait, we want to see you without your shirt off, Neo! Oh, uh, yeah. That's really? why the people came here to the Hard Rock Cafe. Neo, you're disappointed. You are the American mess. You got to show everyone. Uh, he is. All right, this is his encore. He's yes. an American mess. All right, do you guys want to see Neo without his shirt on? Yeah, why not? Oh, it's yeah. a photo op. It's a photo op, everybody. That's he right, is. motherfucker. Yeah, come on, you thought that midget was hot. He is the reigning American mess. There you go. Opie and Anthony has eyes. Hey, it's Scoliope. And this is Scoliope also from Scoliope. American Mess. Scoliope, what's up? He cut his hair, man. He must have booked a part or something. 
Nah, he didn't cut his hair. He had another operation, probably. Oh. oh. Wow. Yeah. Way to, way to bring it up, Bill. Good to see All you. Right. <laughs> if we could have, let's do, um, let's do dueling pipe cleaner spines. <laughs> and have both of you uh, get up there uh, shirtless All right. for the crowd. A great photo op. Hey, uh, Why don't this, you have him play Twister? By the way, this would not be the time to throw stuff into the crowd when we're trying to get something going on here. No. Uh, All right. Yeah, hey, uh, yeah. There we go. All right, All right go. gentlemen, if you would step a little closer to the stage so they can get good photo ops and um, show them your goods. All right, it's Neo is God and Scoliope, everyone. Scoliope. They seem a little shy. Yeah, they don't want to do it. You know how many times they've done this in doctor's offices, but <laughs> somehow in a small <laughs> oh atmosphere, <laughs> seems to be a problem. See, they don't understand Just that. Just standing on that cold scale. Yeah, who <laughs> Scoliope, you gotta take your, your leather jacket off and your shirt for the crowd. Holy shit. I think, do they have hearing impairments too? I, I don't think they're listening to fucking us. Fucking hey. Scoliope has a fucking dash of debonair. Wait, 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 wait. wait. He's dressed like Matthew McConaughey. E Rock, get it done. Get it done. Tell them what they have to do. You guys might want to get your cameras uh, ready for this photo op. E Rock's trying to work on it. That's E Rock, everyone. All right, here they go. Now they know what we need from them. Neo is God and Scoliope, everyone. There comes the jersey. There it is. And uh, and here comes the t-shirt. You might want... He doesn't want to do it. Scoliope ain't going to do it. Scoliope's tapping right. out. Oh, I don't right. want to look. There Dignity, it is. Baby. All right, Neo, walk to, the, walk to the front of the stage so they get a good shot there. There yeah. it goes. Give Neo the is God He's doing the Hulk Hogan poses. <laughs> the Hulk. <laughs> Wow. That's like something out of a black and white textbook. And there you have it. Neo is God. And Scoliope walks off with a, just a tad more dignity. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Scoliope. Wow. That the crowd uh, ha too horrified to applaud. By the way, you just saw the last appearance by Scoliope yeah, on I our think show. So. Uh, give him a hand. Give Neo his God a hand. Why? Because he has some self-respect, you motherfucker. Exactly. He he no room for self-respect on this fucking show. He stripped down his shoulder, his fucking spleen hanging out the side. He's... So he's out. <laughs> he's out. We got. We'll, we'll find someone to we'll take find his somebody place. Else flick. We'll find some other naked, flicked motherfucker that'll strip for you. You <laughs> son of a bitch. Hey, it's great to have dignity. dignity is... Yeah, is, is Ben reading his contract right now? <laughs> Let me tell you what dignity is to this program. Like kryptonite to Superman, my friend. <laughs> we, we can't have dignity. Not on this show. Scoliope says, fuck you. You got to go with your assets, whatever they are. Absolutely. I'll take yes. me in my eye down in my chin and go. You didn't see half a Hulk face uh, arguing. He is, Where is half a Hulk face? I don't know. His eye was running like Niagara He's Falls. Gone. He's out of here. <laughs> and uh, I think he left. <laughs> yeah, he had an appointment. <laughs> Do you think he does that thing where he stands by the edge of a mirror and makes like, so you can see both hands? Oh, you the know same. he's done that. Yeah. Right on the side of a skyscraper. Right. He just cries. <laughs> so, That's uh, how he hits on women. Yeah. Look at me. He just got to walk around with a mirror. <laughs> oh, and he horrible. gets that number. You got that in the date rape drug, you're all set. <laughs> what does uh, Damien Fahey from TRL think of this whole mess? Uh, I haven't seen nipples like that in a long time, actually. Yeah. Aren't they, uh, aren't they, uh, Ew. horrific? Yeah. <laughs> Saveachild.com. Yeah, but that shit now, they, 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 like, take care of it. They put, uh, I saw a show, they were putting titanium rods in people's back yeah. and spine and re-stretching them, but you gotta be, like, a year old when they do it. Yeah. He's past the point of no return, man. He's, a uh, limited edition. You'll never see people like that anymore. Like the, like the dwarf. There's only a few of them. I remember growing up, dwarves all over the place. They're going to be extinct very soon, is what you're flipper, saying. Flipper uh, arm people. Uh, you saw them all over way back when. Thalidomide babies, they weed them out now. They give them the old Francine in the toilet. Pull out the tampon, boom, the kid's gone. You laugh your ass off, you move on with your life. By the way, Anthony, we got a situation here at the Hard Rock Cafe. I yes. don't know if we're allowed to do the uh, hard-boiled egg eating contest. Yeah, yeah. Wow. Uh, I heard there's some kind of health code. Health code, uh, the health board, the board of health came because by. Because it is an eating establishment, and I think the eggs have to be certified in some way, shape, or form before people can eat in they here. They said we don't have a permit. Yeah, no egg eating We permit. don't have a permit uh, to allow people to puke. Is that what it is? A puke permit? I have no I'm idea. I'm going to give you four not to do that again. 
I see Bob Kelly's uh, to the side of the stage. Here comes Bob. Oh, yeah. We also have the uh, uh, Hamptons uh, police uh, want to come out with their bagpipes and do a little no thing way. before the end of the show. Yeah, we we'll could do that. that. Come on. And of, of course, the grand finale, everyone lining what? up to tell their jokes. Right, their <laughs> jokes. They could be any kind of jokes you want. Oh, oh no. And we also have some more karaoke on the way, I guess. Yes, I know. I've been, uh, people have been asking me uh, all, all day if I'm going to be doing uh, a little Neil Diamond. And uh, I don't know. It's been horrific. Do you want to hear Neil Diamond? <laughs> no, nah, they don't want to hear. Do you guys no. want to hear Anthony do yeah. Neil Diamond or what? Yeah! yeah. They, uh, do yeah. Should, I, should I do it? Yeah. yeah. They're calling for you, Anthony. Yeah! And quite frankly, we have nothing else to do with this radio show, so go waste four minutes yeah, for do, us, buddy. Hey, do that. <laughs> go waste a couple minutes for us. Hey, do the hour remix, Anthony. Yeah, really. Do the, <laughs> do the Peter Frampton <laughs> version, will you? <laughs> Opie, is that egg thing over? Huh? The egg thing's done? I think so. You're a wonderful crowd. There's a big guy in the back ready to eat. And the guy from uh, Celebrity Football. Oh, man, it's way back in time. You might know her and you might be able to sing along with this one. Look at the look. Look at the look on that guy's face. Damien, That's check this out. I Anthony doing something. I've heard came out when Anthony was 43. And right, here we go, guys. <laughs> Thank you, ladies and gentlemen. Let's <laughs> hear for Anthony! You made the song yours. You made it yours. There he is, your next American Idol, Anthony! Most people would have sang that fucking song just like Neil Diamond. You made it yours! I made it my own. You made it your own, I made baby. It my own, baby. <laughs> <laughs> hey, you guys want to hear the other side of the spectrum with this karaoke? Of course. I'm going to pass, but I'm, uh, I'm going to bring up my brother. Holy shit. He's the best singer in my family. Uh-oh. You thought Anthony had pipes. You thought Anthony had pipes! <laughs> That's my brother Elmo who designed the fine t-shirts that everyone is wearing. This, uh, this is going to sound a little different oh, yeah. than what you just heard. But uh, quite enthusiastic he is. A toast! Here's to you! Ain't that Here's a villain from 16 me. blocks? What's the cop name from 16 blocks? That guy, the villain. And if I can, oh, we disagree. Fuck my cousin Danny, here's to me. <laughs> Your brother's gonna bomb. Oh, we already know he's gonna bomb. Watch oh, this. All right. No, there's no doubt about it. Am I ruining another bit? Sorry. Yes, you are. You just ruined it. Once again, he's. This is for Kitchen Moon on my face. Nah. from the start song, but you got me in the middle of the song. <laughs> That's my brother Elmo, everyone. Wow. You're a star. I guess I You're can explain. You're a star. I guess I need to explain. My brother takes it very seriously when, when people take shots at us. I got We told him, you got on the show, him. he's nuts. Yeah. He wanted to fly to, that's the guy who wanted to fly to Chicago and beat the shit out of Man Cow for yeah. talking shit about us on uh, Fox. Uh-huh. So there you go. That was some aggression that was building up in him. And he's the real deal. I could see that um, on PLJ <laughs> right. or uh, another one of these uh, commercial terrestrial radio stations. That that's the type of music they need. The what iTunes. do you think of that? Now you see a lot of new music on CRL. I think what that think? that needs to be available on iTunes very soon. <laughs> iTunes for download. Yeah, yeah I think so. Absolutely. You're going to be uh, hearing a lot of people downloading that to their iPod. I see it all over. Yeah. I, I, it's gonna yeah, it's gonna explode. <laughs> so, Sweeping the nation. <laughs> Plus, who doesn't love a happy drunk? <laughs> right. Right. <laughs> wow. That's some aggression that's been building up. Yeah. He listens to the show every day, and he just gets more and more pissed off oh. every day. All right. Once again, my brother Elmo, uh, what can I tell you? I think we should get your mom up here to do, you know. Oh, my God. I don't, uh, I don't know. If she, let, let, let me. She's shaking if, her head no already. I can see from here. If she had some wine spritzers yeah. during the time when, uh, before, between she got here and now, we might see it, but I don't know. Uh, Dawn, 
Dawn, is there a clue that my mom might actually do? Bobby McGee, sing it here. She's shaking oh, her no. head. She's no. saying no. Wow. She's going to need a chiropractor. She's shaking her head no so hard. Wow. No? Because the crowd loves, you know. crowd's nice and warmed up. She's, <laughs> she's retired from performing live. She just doesn't want to uh, follow that. <laughs> she doesn't want to follow my brother. Oh, <laughs> let me yeah. performance. Ladies and gentlemen, Anthony's mom. That's my mommy. Mommy has hit the stage. Hi, mommy. And the bagpipes. Oh, nice. And the bagpipes. Come here, mommy. Stand up, you're Irish. Huh? Just hang out. Is that Opie's mom? Is that your mom? It's Anthony's That's mom. That's your mom? Yes. Look out, your well, mom. Anthony, your is mother it, is. Is it possible? You? Is it possible for us to get a black marching band in this motherfucker from Howard University? <laughs> and drums from Southampton, New York. Very nice. Eastern Long Island Police. Pipes and drums, Southampton, New York. And the shot girl is passing out more Jägermeister shots. That's what we need at this point. That's exactly what we need at this point. You, you. And there they go, the Eastern Long Island Police. Pipes and drums from Southampton, New York. Bravo. You gotta love that. Everyone's, you know, everyone's loving that except for Patrice O'Neill. You know, Opie, when they're not playing uh, the bagpipes, they are protecting Southampton uh, by ticketing Mercedes Benzes and uh, whatever other dangerous uh, lines of uh, work uh, the Southampton. What is this? Does Southampton need a police department? How long does it take to learn to be the bass drum guy in that? <laughs> That's like right above the maracas. <laughs> hey, Anthony, let's talk to your Boom. mom for a little while. Yeah. Is she going to sing a song or what? All right, uh, Mommy, does your mic work? No. No, it doesn't. I can't hear it. There it is. There it is. All right, Mommy, well, you're here. But, but I, I, no, no, I want to chat for a little bit first. Now, you have said you haven't had anything to drink. So you're completely sober. Not one spritzer or anything. What the fuck is wrong with you? You, you drink all the, every time I come over the house, you drink. You come to a gig at St. Patty's Day and, oh, is this the one day a year? <laughs> <laughs> Mom's backwards, she lives on Bizarro World. Yeah. No, one, this, but you figured you weren't, what are you, a designated driver or something? What? Is Sal drinking? No, Sal doesn't drink. Of course, drink. Sal doesn't drink. So uh, you want to do a little shot of Jaeger? Maybe that'll loosen your vocal cords up and you can sing a little Bobby McGee? Yes. yes. Do a come shot on, of Jaeger, right Mommy. Here. Come on, Mommy. Here, here. Cheers the crowd there. Rick. Oh, come on. We used to do coke together. <laughs> <laughs> and he ain't lying. <laughs> All right. Ah, that's, oh, that's good, good stuff. No, she didn't that's like good stuff. Empty stomach. Now, what do you think? We got, 
the okay. karaoke machine. It'll give you the words. Okay. Just wait for the words to queue up. You'll see the color change, and then sing along. Uh, okay. Know. All right. I think I could do this. Take the wireless. Give her the karaoke mic. What song is she gonna do, Anthony? <laughs> My mommy's not showing her tits, you animals. <laughs> <laughs> Disrespectful fucks. <laughs> <laughs> Now, you can't fool his mother. Oh, there's Anthony's mom. You can't fool his mother. Waving to the animals out there. <laughs> Anthony, what song is she going to do today? Isn't that great how I throw into the lions? Oh, oh, they're going nuts for Anthony's mom. Look at that. Anthony's mom, everyone. Bravo. Bring it down the house. That's my mommy. Bravo, mommy. Great job. Oh, I got a kiss. I got a kiss. Mommy kissed Anthony. That's so You're nice. You're done. <laughs> Tell Sal, uh, no offense, and if Sal shoots anybody, I get in trouble for it. <laughs> yeah, tell him to control himself. Anthony. A cougar. They're doing a cougar. Don't call my mother a cougar. <laughs> Did they just call your mom a cougar? A cougar's an old broad that goes hunting for young guys. He's not my mom. He looks like looks Santarelli. Like, Remember he looks that? Like Santarelli right up front. This guy's gonna pass out. <laughs> Look at him. Oh, that is funny, Look, man. Look, her husband is Sal. He's a retired union organizer. Ixnay on the Uger K. Less a uye ibe atche. One unwe ille einfe uye. <laughs> what a fucked up day this has become. Cementier Ouzche. Yeah, very good. Anthony, I got to tell you, your family yes. has a lot of talent there. Yeah, we're still trying to find it. Your, your family has talent and my family has psychosis. Anger so. and psychosis. <laughs> so it kind of works out. I think sleep. that's the dynamic of the, the whole show, too. Absolutely. It's like there's anger, psychosis. Little talent. People don't believe when I say I'm the normal one in the family, yeah. but I think my brother proved that point today. <laughs> All right, what do you want to do? You want to take a you break? Know, uh, what's up, Bill? You got that guy right there checking his watch. He's yeah. like half a shot away from passing out and yeah, banging his we, head off the stage. Can yeah. we just get him one shot? We can't do the happen. egg thing. We can't do the egg thing, we, no. 20 bucks when he passes out. Do you need a permit for that? Look at look, look oh, this. That guy is <laughs> shot, man. This oh, look guy at his is stomach. He, he's he's out out on be, his feet. Could be the drunkest guy here. Look at it. He's we, still trying to figure out what time it is. He's he gave got up, a watch. He gave up on his watch. He's, he's looking, looking at, at another guy's watches. watch next to him. Dude, you are fucking. We were all pointing at him, and he has oh, no yeah. idea. He's looking for the guy we're pointing at. <laughs> hey, Anthony, I think we got one more karaoke. Uh, yes. Jimmy Norton's in Atlanta, but uh, we're going to represent Jimmy Norton today. Uh, Black Sabbath was inducted into the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame. Yes. And in honor of that is our own Danny stepping up to the karaoke machine to oh, sing a yeah. little bit of War Pigs. Danny, War Pigs. everyone, this is Danny. Everyone knows this one. It's a favorite. Sing along. Danny, everyone, yes. Representing Black Sabbath. And the guy, the drunk guy, is officially falling asleep on his feet. How do you fall asleep to Black Sabbath? Yeah, Black Sabbath, big crowd yelling, and you fell asleep. Don't look for the guy we're talking about. It's you. Yeah. I it's know. you. You keep looking around like, where's this idiot they're yeah. talking about? There are a bunch of drunk guys, but you yeah. are the drunk guy. You're the drunk guy, dude. They're, they're Front all you are pointing hammered. at you. you. What, are, what are you chewing on? He's chewing on... Yeah, you're not here. fucked up? You were just asleep on your feet. All right, here we go. We're going to talk to the guy. Oh! Huh? Dude, not at all! Not at all? Not at all! You were asleep on your feet. I was not! Not at all! What are you drinking over there in front of you? Uh, it's pink! The you, fucking shit pink! You, really you know what? I get this you. guy. He's just going to Nothing. denial. This is like he's practicing for when the state troopers pull him over. Right. Get you out of Granberry. I don't drink 19 years. Yeah? Just like that normally? Wow, dude, then you better go to a doctor. You're not gonna... <laughs> <laughs> I should, right? <laughs> All right. Fall asleep on my feet. I couldn't believe it. 
All right, very good. I'm sitting there with oh. my camera with you. I can't believe I'm not in the sleep. I listen. We're gonna take a break, Anthony. We're gonna have the grand finale. We got Twitchels who wants to sing New York, uh, New York for everybody. Oh, everyone knows the words to, to that. To one. close out sure. the show. Also, uh, what else we got? Oh, we got people that are gonna wind up and tell their best jokes today. Best jokes because uh, that's what it's all about on St. Patrick's. It's a tradition that fun. we did. We started last year. We'll do it again this yeah. year. It's Opie and Anthony and our pals live from the Hard Rock Cafe for our St. Patty's Day broadcast. All right, I think we're back live from the Hard Rock Cafe. It's our St. Patty's Day broadcast. It's the Opie and Anthony show on XM Satellite Radio. We got Patrice O'Neill making his way back to the stage. We have Bill Burr up here, and we haven't even really talked to him. Bob Kelly is also helping us out today. What's up, Bobby? doing is this on yeah it's oh, on yeah. it's Bobby. happening it's on i don't know how this sounds as a radio broadcast bobby. but i gotta tell you we're having a great time but bob, this is like one of your holidays right bob kelly Rob, robert patrick robert kelly Pat right here dude. kelly dude. Not an right. ounce of irish blood in him though dude. Dude. the crowd dude. looks like it's dude. lenny clark over and over and over again <laughs> just a bunch of lenny clarks it's lenny clark cloned <laughs> dude <laughs> a bunch, dude. bunch of chunky gray-haired dude. irishman dude. 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 dude what's up there dude Hey, um, Bill Burr dude, wanted to dude, talk to your mom, Patrick's by the dude. way, Anthony. Hey, why? Because <laughs> I was just wondering, like, like, you're such a classy lady, man. I don't, I don't, what happened to you? Uh, <laughs> you're like this gun-collecting redneck and shit. She looks like she could be at like I, one of those Republican conventions. I'm a uh, gun-collecting psychopath. I'm not really a redneck. Like, I would shoot a redneck. All right, it was a hack reference. So, I was running out of shit it's early. You know, but I don't know what happened. I guess I took <laughs> after uh, my dad. You know, something like that. Your mom is, um, she's gorgeous. Uh, well, oh, thank like, you. Like pretty, pretty. Don't gorgeous. Just, no, I, I, you know what, Mike, you know what, I Your mama look, looks delicious, that nigger. That Sing fucker, better. don't talk I'm about her. I'm not saying, I'm just saying, you look older than your mom. I mean, and, and before you start complimenting her, she taught me every racist thing I know. <laughs> I love your mama. <laughs> <laughs> All right. I just like your mama. Bobby's gonna rub like one mama. out. Love your okay. mama. You're gonna rub one out to Anthony's mother. No, no I didn't say that, Anthony. Here Anytime, you, you know, your mother's really good looking. That means later on. She's Horrible. Only, she's I didn't know it was your mom. That, stop, don't rub your back. <laughs> Come on. Your mama's only 66. Come on. Patrice, man. Ah, You're getting Sal pissed off. Disrespectful. That's so, you wanna hear Twitchell's do New York, New York? Uh, you know. No, but no. okay. Why not? We're just killing time at this point. This a karaoke favorite. Yeah. Hey, uh, Opie. Yeah. Boy, everybody with all gets those involved. Eggs. Huh? Where, what are they doing with all those eggs? I don't know what they're going to do with the eggs. We got a lot of fat guys backstage that are really bummed out they can't do the egg eating contest. Why don't we give them to the homeless? Why don't we give them to the crowd? <laughs> <laughs> Why don't we throw them at the crowd? <laughs> This is how the brainstorming goes on this show. Yeah. We can, what can we do to get fired? That's <laughs> pretty right. much how it starts. Let's bring out Twitchels once again. All right, you twitching ass. Oh, Every time he hits the stage, they yell jump in. Yeah, he should have sang to jump. Should have sang Van Halen. Hey, getting his wireless oh, mic together. Oh, or Pointer oh. Sisters. All right. See sleepy guy in the All right uh, hey, Twitchell, you familiar with this song? What? Have you sang the song what? before? Yeah, I sang, I sang yeah. New York, New York before. Yeah. Yes. Okay. I love it. Yeah. I love Sinatra. I love crooning. Oh, oh. Yes. Uh, yes. Once again, it's Twitchell's. There we go. Oh, boy. <laughs> I've never seen Twitchell's. In the heart of Times Square, it's Twitchell's doing New York, New York at the Hard Rock Cafe. No better time or place. In a city that doesn't sleep. Oh, he's selling it. Oh. Now he's Liza Minnelli. And find I'm a number one. Uh, top of the heap. Can, can you read? <laughs> These little town blues. It's up to you, <laughs> New York. Oh, shit. 
Now he's spooning the crowd. He shoved his hat up his ass and ran off stage. <laughs> he destroyed one of our wireless microphones, yeah. by the way. He turreted a microphone. <laughs> he had it in his hand. He twitched so bad, the mic flew, and wires ripped out of both sides of the, uh, the receiver and the microphone itself. He destroyed it. I think that's known as a death grip. Yeah, he had the death grip on the mic. I really thought he was getting electrocuted like everyone else. That and then he nuts. started twitching so badly, yeah, we thought he was getting electrocuted. Which would have been a great finish for the show. <laughs> Absolutely. Twitching, getting electrocuted. We might have to do that. All right. We're running out of show. Thank God. Yes, quickly. Uh, <laughs> Thank God. Quickly coming to the point where we can just drink without the responsibility of having to do a show. Right. You uh, you uh, having anything afterwards or what else? Absolutely, yes. You got like what? Uh, 30 seconds of an Irish in you? One uh, thirty second? That's about it. Got to yeah. be a little Mick in you, right? And a lot of Red Bull in me at this point. Red Bull? We also have uh, Dr. Ian Smith backstage from the Celebrity Fit Club. Supposedly Michael Strahan stopping by. Did he stop by or not? We don't I know. have no <laughs> idea who's back there. <laughs> who's running this, sh this show at this point? We don't even know. <laughs> we got Master Paul that wants to sing another song. What? who claims he's not drinking is, is, is asleep on his feet. He's just tired. He's resting his eyes. <laughs> ah, there we go. He's resting his eyes. He's resting his eyes? Yeah, right on his man tits. <laughs> Have you ever seen a bigger collection of degenerates? This guy was sleeping. I was watching him standing. I was like, yeah. wow, this guy's an anomaly. Yeah, but he's, swear he's telling us he's not drinking or anything. Dude, then you have some, what, ne neurological? You got narcolepsy or something? What do you got? You broke your neck, man. You broke your neck and you smoked pot. What? I broke my neck in a road rage accident. He's high. A road I rage accident. I was accident. high. In a road rage he's accident. He's fucking token. Listen. You he broke your neck. neck. In a road rage accident, they put two cadaver bones... Very funny. Two cadaver bones and a titanium plate in my neck. You got so AIDS. Every now and then I you just shut my AIDS. eyes. You got AIDS. You got AIDS. <laughs> you got AIDS. Holy shit. You got AIDS. You got AIDS. You got AIDS. And the you ever popular AIDS. You Got AIDS you chant. Got AIDS. It's not a party until you hear the You Got AIDS <laughs> chant. Uh, you guys are animals. Hey, <laughs> I Dr. Got Dr. Ian Smith, they have you assholes in this place. <laughs> so because you have the cadaver bones in you, occasionally you just die on your feet and then come back too. And the guy in the coffin twitches a little bit. Hey, Ian, what's his target weight? <laughs> he needs to lose about 100 pounds. <laughs> yeah, he should definitely uh, be on this show, man. What is he sucking? What is that? Yeah, what do you have in your mouth? medicated pop. A what? That's a medicated pot. Oh, I heard about these marijuana lollipops. No, no, no. Yes, you're fucked up on pot lollipops. Pot? Pot? It's a pot lollipop. No. Joe Rogan eats them. Fentanyl. No. It's fentanyl. It's what? Fentanyl. It's fentanyl. And what does that do to you, sir? Makes you tired and fall asleep on your feet? Painkiller. It makes you, it takes away the pain, but it does have some side effects. And you're yeah. drinking while you're, you you're, one? you're drinking why. while you're taking that? You want one? The guy's drinking alcohol while he's taking painkillers. He's gonna kill himself. How about a couple no, he's, not, he's not drinking alcohol, yeah, but now we know it's... why he's passing out. Yeah, yeah now we know it's why he's passing out. It's in lollipop form. Yeah. yeah. It's in a lollipop. Yeah. Let me see what one looks like uh, unwrapped and unsucked on. <laughs> yeah, as opposed to that soggy stick in your mouth. All right, we That's got to the bottom of what like. this guy's Let's all say. about. There it is. The it looks like a fucking tampon, dude. You're sucking on tampons. Hey, Let's see what this is. Uh, only there patients go. already. Oh my god! All right, you know what? Right. Who cares about the lollipop drug thing? We got this this girl. Get her on stage Very for a high. photo op. We wow. lost control of the radio show. We might as well see the tits at this point. Jesus, those are fucking perfect. 
right. What's her name, E-Rock? This is Map of Hawaii. Oh, the Map of Hawaii wow, couple. Wow, here they are. These guys uh, fuck live on wow. our show on Pal Talk. What's up? Nice to wow. see you. Wow. <laughs> Map of Hawaii. Pleasure Pleasure to meet How you. are you? Wow, man. What's wow. up, buddy? How are you? Give the lollipop yeah, back to the guy. All right. So what are they going to do oh, for us? The lollipop. What are they going to do for us now that they're on the stage, Anthony? Uh, well, I think everybody would love to see her loveliness. Uh, tits. Yeah, watch the cameras go off in two flashes. Oh, my God. Hey, make sure you turn this way. Yeah, turn this way. Turn this way. Do a spin. Do a spin. Do a spin. Do a spin. Do a spin for the guys back here. Yeah. Yeah, like a spin. Oh, there you go. What's up with that, huh? There you go. Dr. Ian Smith, how many pounds do you think she needs to lose? Hey, dude, let me see your odds. Zero. <laughs> wow. She has, she's got her target. Hey, dude, hey, wait. Wait. Hey, hey, guys, don't we want to see a cock? Yeah, let's see your cock, dude. Take your Whoa. cock out. Whoa. Take your cock out, Ken. Nothing? What? Nothing? Well, all right. No, who wants to see a cock? Is there any ladies out there that think they could beat that? Just asking. Get up here. Right here. I saw some tits right here. They, uh, by the right way, here. Get up here. They Your were tits on, are nice, too. They were on Pal Talk. Yeah, and Bobby on. from Revere. He I fucked her on a dining room table, and yes. it was fantastic. Live during the show, yes. Yes. Wow. Look at these. Look at these. Right. This is oh. Oh. There you go. Do a spin. Do a spin. Do a spin. Do a spin. There you wow. go. Those are nice. And those yeah, are real. Yeah, that's XOI real. Because I don't know if they're real. Let's real. Just make sure. They're real. They're real. Dr. Yeah, Smith, what do you think? Real. Real. Absolutely. That's uh, XOXO on Pal Talk all the time. Very real. Great. Just as lovely in person as she is in a little postage stamp picture. I didn't know Laverne from Laverne and Shirley was so sexy. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my goodness. <laughs> Did I see a uh, uh, baby girl in the audience too? It looked like she was there. Well, uh, yeah, now we're oh, getting all the girls. Oh, look at that. Lucy's in here too. Lucy. Lucy. Where's Lucy? All the Lucy. girls of Pal Talk. Put all the your girls shirt from down. Pal Talk. Tracy. Where's Tracy. Luke? Where's wow, look, they're all here. All the Pal Talk like girls are here. It's like seeing celebrities, Opie. Oh. The girls of Pal Talk. Here's another girl from Pal Talk. Wait, wait, turn. There you yeah. go. Turn, turn. Yeah. yeah. Very nice. Bravissimo. I got to ask the girls of Pal Talk. Her yes. body English suggests maybe possible lawsuit later. You but think so? Uncomfortable. Anthony. Good luck with that. We got a team of lawyers. <laughs> I got to ask uh, Dr. Ian Smith, calcium deficient on that last... Uh... <laughs> she, <laughs> she is full of mammary lactose. All right, All right. She, needs she needs more protein. Oh, yeah. she needs, a little, needs a protein shake. <laughs> There you go, uh, another girl yeah. flashing. Turn, turn. Very nice. Hey, yes. hey. Oh, it looks painful. The looks guys nice. love it. Is that, I think, is that Norton? You're an Irish girl, right? Uh, you're yeah. an I Irish girl? Dude, you're, she doesn't even know where she is. You're an Irish girl, <laughs> you're right? asking Jesus her hard Christ. questions. Yeah. She looks like Thor's girlfriend. <laughs> Happy St. Patrick's Day. You too, white oh. bitch. You know what? I want you to... <laughs> I would love to... I, Patrice, you I want tits. you to tell me to show your tits. <laughs> you, show your... Show your tits, show your tits, baby. Say, say it mean, say it mean. Say. Come on, bitch, you ain't running this say, movie. Patrice, you choke Hey, bitch, just pull out those uncooked eggs and show everybody, please. There you go. There you oh. go. Oh. <laughs> wow. There you go. There is something going on there, huh? Oh, that's what I'm talking oh, about. Oh, boy. <laughs> I think a little jungle fever going on over there. Oh, yeah. wait a minute, wait a minute. Yeah. 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 And this is where we get yeah, shut yeah, down, yeah. everybody. Yeah. Wow. Let's go. As she tries to take her jeans off. That's what I'm yeah. talking about. Very nice, yes. <laughs> there nice. you go. Hey, there's no problem with that. All right. All right, there you go. <laughs> are, there moles, are there moles on that, too? <laughs> hey, Anthony, I think it might be time for the jokes. Well, so maybe not. Oh, shit. Maybe All we right. should pass on the jokes. Hey, All right. <laughs> Look at they got the cameras out and the cell phone. Oh yeah, yeah. Oh, is, yeah. Look at Sleepy, he's awake now. Gotta get that <laughs> young man. Give a big hand for the Aryan princess. That's your people. That's right. Yeah. <laughs> Look at her, she got a Celtic thing on her back. Yeah. That's yeah, Elizabeth. Yeah. Her name's Elsbeth. <laughs> <laughs> the right. sacrifice out of the dragon. Oh boy, this is Oh jeez. Yeah. Whoa, 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 whoa. The back row. This way, this way. Hey, hey, hey the, the judges. Gallery. The judges. Whoa! Yeah. Wow! Wait, no, no, no. Are those real? Stop lifting up! Like, let's see what in their in their full glory. Let your arms down. Let them down. Let them down. Let them down. Let them down. No, no, no. Let them down. Yeah, there you go. There you go. Right. 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 Are, are those real? Real? Of course they're real. Nigga, you put it's a joke, you jackass. I like how you lobbied for that shit, Patrice. Hey, let's ask Doctor Ian Smith what diet he suggests for. Yeah. Booty McBoo. Yeah, from Pal Talk. Let me see. Yep, that's her. Hey, what's up, baby? 
What was that girl on Fact of Life? Was it Natalie? Uh, <laughs> <laughs> At least wait till they walk off. Yeah. <laughs> Jesus. Yes, yes, sir. Uh, raising your hand. Her target, her target weight loss. Why would you? Sh- why would we want to see your tits, sir? You are actually pushing to get up there. Yeah, you, you want to see my cock? No. Oh boy, look at the time. We gotta go. <laughs> no, we don't. Yeah. No, we don't. <laughs> no, we don't. Here we go. Here we go. Uh, oh, we got another yeah. girl. Yes, that's the. Uh, Everyone loves Harry Potter. The Harry Potter girl yep. with the boobs. Uh, 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 been there, done that. She likes. She looks like the girl that keeps. Uh, not keep her. Donald Sutherland. Ah, forget oh, it. Yeah, that's that's All right, turn, turn around. Turn around to the judges. Turn to the around judges. the judges. Now she's uh, fat and in shape. What do you suggest? <laughs> She's out of shape and in shape. Ian, what do you suggest right. she do? Yeah, let's ask Dr. Ian Smith for some advice here. <laughs> she's, a, she's what we call a dichotomy. <laughs> <laughs> does, does she eat and do push-ups at the same time? <laughs> yeah, <right. laughs> Harry Potter and the 32 C's. <laughs> she's got that, like, schoolgirl, I'm a librarian's yeah. daughter kind of thing. You know? Yeah. It, they're, they're, they're good, though, right? Yo, I think yeah, that was absolutely, nice. Absolutely. Oh, they're uh, chanting oh. all at once. They, they want a mass oh. boobing. Yeah, they want on. a mass boobing. A boobing. Mass boobing. Should we get um, a mass boobing going on or what? It's like a, it's like a bad softball team. <laughs> here they come. All of them get up here. And any other girls that haven't been up that want to join in. All right. Let's Tracy, get Tracy. up. Come on up. Look at this. Dude. Bring up the bad Wait. news hoes. Oh. These girls are. Uh, oh, there she is. She was the one in her underwear laying in bed uh, yesterday. <laughs> we saw you in your underwear laying on your bed. My God, these girls are ridiculous. Uh, this is better than the Jesus oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Right. Turn, spin around for the judges. judges. One for the judges. For the judges. Uh, judges. You got to spin around for us. You have to spin slowly. Wait, slow. Yeah. <laughs> very nice. She's going to pass out, but very nice. <laughs> Well, she gave it real quick. She's like, no pictures. Wait, one more All time, right. one more time, one more time. Patrice Yesterday on, uh, on Pal Talk, she just hung out in her bra and panties laying in bed during the whole show. Fantastic. And there she goes. Why do they suck their stomach in Wait like, a minute. the back? Don, Don Knox has something to say. <laughs> 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 Go ahead, Mr. Furley. Tell, <laughs> tell Jack Tripper that faggot to get out the house. <laughs> Fuck Anthony. the kids, man. Look at the twat. <laughs> he looks like he looks like an old Hulk Hogan. <laughs> <laughs> He's very disappointed. He wants to see twat. That's he hope. He wait for Neil Young. <laughs> he thought Neil Young was really here. <laughs> Not quite. What, what do you want to see, Motorhead? What's the, what's the problem, Lemmy? <laughs> I don't want to see tits. That's a goddamn show. Why not? What's wrong with tits? I see more than that at home. Uh, something do. tells no, me they're not up. No, the- but you don't got a woman who can take her left tit throw her right side of her shoulder. I, I do. <laughs> Wait, your should, chick. Shouldn't you be somewhere oh, no, building a motorcycle? What's going on? What's going on? Your chick could take her left tit and put it over her right shoulder? That's, uh, that's a trick I like to see. Come on, sir. Stop. What was Vietnam like? <laughs> My- Come on, Rosie. Stop trying to tease the audience and pull them. Jesus. Pull those bag of potatoes out. She's getting a good reaction. And one for let's the see, judges. Let's see. Turn oh, to the judges. The ju- Ooh, that looks nice. Look at those. Oh, there you go. Yeah, 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 wow. Party, man. Yeah, she, she, All right, do a jumping jack. <laughs> she's eating too much, uh, too much carbohydrates, huh, Ian? <laughs> Ian, what's your professional assessment there? Yeah. Uh, yeah. Watch this. Hey, Ian, you are what you eat. Two, two man, boiled potatoes. Man, take 50 pounds <laughs> off, please. I mean, <laughs> her target weight is death. If you are what you eat, I don't think the USDA recommends moose noses. Uh, problem? I think somebody got rejected. They got sent home. Oh, wow. She, she want to flash. Have a record. Right, sure, they don't have to flash if they don't want to. That's all right. It's only the girls. We actually want, want girls to show up uh, at our events. <laughs> I can't get over this guy looking like Hulk Hogan in 80 years. <laughs> well, he's really like pissed that. off. He wants to see Twad, and he has a girl at home that can throw what? Her left boob over her right shoulder? Yeah. That's from years of hanging on the back of a shaky Harley <laughs> Davidson. Sure <laughs> can. Just like tamped everything down at sure the bottom can. of the tip. <laughs> Down. He looks like he's got an El Camino. Sure can. No. Yeah. <laughs> he just keeps saying, sure can, no. <laughs> yeah. All right. Ladies and gentlemen, this is Hulk Hogan without steroids. <laughs> yeah. 
All right, I think we're wrapping up the program, Anthony. Anthony. Right, we've done it all today. Oh, boy. Next yes. time a president gets assassinated, that's the guy they're going to blame it on. I'm and, the patsy. And well, they should. He's got a ponytail, too. That's good. You a biker? Dude, you, you, on, a, you on a bike? You on a bike? You on a Harley? No, I can build them. Oh. All right, why don't we thank some people and get the hell out of here, Anthony? <laughs> We, first of all, we want to thank John at the Hard Rock Cafe for throwing yeah. the shindig. If John girls want to come shit. on stage and flash as we did, uh, do the thank yeah. yous, that would help as us out. As the credits roll, the also girls also want to thank us. Don Wicklin for helping us out from XM Satellite Radio. Marlon doing the karaoke from MercuryEntertainment.com. Great job. Keith the Cop, our security. Keith the Cop, Mike Cole, Phil Schur. Also, Jägermeister and the Jägermeister Shot Girls. Roland from Central Talent Booking. Also, let's hear for Hulk Hogan. The Hulkster. Damien Fahey from TRL. Want to thank this girl go. again for flashing. Very, very nice. To the judges, the judges, honey. Yes, don't forget the judges. Uh, hey, the we, judges. We always Sweet. miss out. Also want to thank our crew. Ooh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Nice. nice. Which like includes that. Ben okay. Sparks, Steve C. We haven't even introduced Steve C to the crowd at all today. Where's also want to thank E-Rock, Danny, Nathaniel, Travis, Derek, and the rest. Master Poe for singing. Anthony's mom, my brother, for proving that our family is psychotic. I Steve, think Master Poe Show him it. your shoes, Steve. Come on, show him your shoes. Yeah, you guys want to see Steve C's shoes? Sure. He's got sure. his flame wear on today. There you go. Steve C, everybody. Yeah. Hey. Also want to thank Dr. Ian Smith from Celebrity Fit Club for stopping by. Who else? Uh, Rich sure Boss. That. Bill Burr, everyone. Let's hear yeah, it for Bill Burr. Burr. Hey. Hey. Also, Bob Kelly, everyone, helping out the program. Patrice O'Neill, Patrice, doing his uh, relationship show tomorrow night on this channel from 8 to 10 p.m. East Coast time. And uh, I think we're out of here, man. I of course, let's thank Anthony's mom and everybody else. And if we didn't thank you, I'm sorry. You guys, you guys are the best. Thank you so much for listening to the Opie and Anthony program. Cheers. We're going to hang around and party a little more. It's our St. Patty's Day broadcast. And thanks a lot, guys. We're out of here.